30, there's a nationwide battle for police officers, and right now local police are the target. The Seattle Police Department is working to recruit officers with a billboard here in Detroit. 7 Action News reporter Kim Russell takes a look at what's behind the officer shortage. Recruiters here at the Ferndale Police Department have been working to spread the message across the state. They are hiring. Now they're competing with police departments around the country, working to fill positions in a nationwide police shortage. This is a look at the digital billboard up right now along the lodge in Detroit near Wyoming. It comes after several reports about Detroit police struggling to keep officers. The department lost more than 100 officers this year to other departments. Currently, Detroit police officers are paid a starting salary of just under $18 an hour. You can expect to make somewhere in the range of $74,000, $75,000 starting. The Seattle Police Department says it isn't just working to recruit from Detroit, but from the suburbs. The department has dozens of openings and expects more as officers retire. It also has billboards up in Chicago and Indianapolis. We're keeping our options open. We aren't just hiring from Detroit and we aren't just hiring from Chicago. And we're really trying to draw the best possible candidates that we can. It's a tough job and we're under scrutiny uh, like we've never been before. Sergeant Baron Brown from the Ferndale Police Department says the booming economy and police scandals across the country have impacted the profession over the last decade. You know, there were 700 people taking the test for a couple of positions and now we can have multiple positions and only 20 or 30 people show any interest. Ferndale Police are also hiring and offering up to $3,000 as a signing bonus. Uh, the things you get to do are, are really fulfilling and and you get to help your community. If you're interested in a position here at the Ferndale Police Department or in Seattle, we'll have links at our website WXYZ.com. Kim Russell, 7 Action News. All right, Kim, thank you. Well, the heated discussion about